Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video I will show you a game between Bobby Fischer and Bent Larsen. This epic blitz game was played in Santa Monica in 1966. Anything important happened to you in 1966. Fischer had white pieces and he started with e4. Larsen played knight to f6, the Alehin defense. e5, knight to d5, d4, the standard move. d6, knight to f3, d takes on e5, knight takes on e5, knight to d7, challenging the knight on e5. White to move, what would you do in this position if you had white pieces? Fischer played knight takes pawn on f7, kaboom! This move was seen for the first time in the game Kupa Popov in 1963. So it was three years before this game and white lost the game. The game continued, king takes knight, queen to h5, check, king to e6, queen to g4, check, king to f7, queen to h5, check, black to move, if g6 then queen takes knight, king to e6 was played, queen to g4, check. This was the critical moment. Black can choose between draw and trying to win by playing king to d6. What would you do? Most players would be happy with a draw. But Fischer predicted that Larsen would try to win. And this is what happened. Instead of going for a draw, king to d6, going for the full point. c4, attacking the knight, black to move, knight from 7 to f6. Let's take it back. How about knight from 5 to f6? What happens then? Then c5 check, and black is in trouble. For example, king to d5, knight to c3 check, king to c6, and then bishop to b5 check, mate. Back to our game, knight on 7 to f6, back in the queen, queen to g3 check, King to e6, c takes on d5, check, queen takes on d5. The material is now equal, but black king is not well placed. Knight to c3, attacking the queen and sacrificing the pawn, queen takes pawn on d4. Bishop to e3, queen to b4, threatening queen takes pawn on b2. How would you defend the pawn? Perhaps some players would castle queenside. Fischer played a3, daring Larsen to take the pawn. Queen takes on b2 was played, forking two pieces. Which piece would you save? Fischer played bishop to c4, check. King to d7, rook to d1, check. King to e8, white played a move when black resigned, and the move is knight to b5, attacking the pawn on c7, threatening a checkmate. Larsen resigned. For the entertainment purpose I will show you just one line. e6, knight takes on c7, check. King to e7, queen to d6, check. King to f7, bishop takes on e6, check. Bishop takes bishop, queen takes bishop, check. King to g6, knight takes rook. And perhaps next move white can castle and win easily. What a game. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.